Well, how are we doing out there? I hope you're all spot on. Thanks for watching the video. Now I've been shopping. I've been to Aldi. Come and have a look at what I've got. So I've seen this was new. Now I don't know how new it is because Aldi have a, a habit of putting new on things and it's been out a long time. But it did say new. Uh, this is Oakhurst Gammon Steaks. Two of them smoked. A little traffic light system there, look. So these were three pounds and fifteen pence for two steaks. So let's have a look at the packaging. Oh, I do, I do like a, a gammon steak. So there is the nutritional information there. If you want to pause that and have a look at that, by all means, go ahead. Um, smoked rindless gammon steaks with added water, formed from cuts of cured pork leg. 450 grams little GB sticker there look they're not frozen these they are the ways to cook directions for use always wash hands that's a good tip grill cook under a preheated medium grill for 10 to 12 minutes turning halfway or you can shell or fry a well-oiled frying pan and cook over a medium heat for 10 to 12 minutes turning occasionally so let's get these open and see what we've got. So we're going to do the seal peel test now. Let's see if we can get this off um, in a one. Uh, this is in real time. I'm not editing this bit, although if it does go on, I will have to edit it. Unfortunately, I can't, it's, it's failed. It, the, the, the tabs bust look. That is it. Is that right? I'm going to have to get some scissors on this. I am going to have to edit it. So if in doubt, get some um, decorators' scissors on the job. <laughs> my, um, my nippers have been doing a bit of arts and crafts. I got a lovely kit sent to me. Um, Sally, thank you very much for that. And children have nicked the other scissors. They don't use them on their own. They are supervised. Now, I'm going to have to cut that as well there, look. So. Try and break the seal because they're fresh. They're really packed well, obviously, to keep them keep them fresh. Have a look at that. Right, I will get it on. I will get it cooking, and I will bring you back when it's done. So I've, I've put it under the grill, and it's. I've just switched it on, so it's. It's going to be a slow process with this grill. I know I've got a grill on my multi cooker. However, I can't see it cooking when I put the lid down and I want to be able to see it. And this is at head height, so it's quite convenient. So if you like this kind of video, please give it a thumbs up. Um, and if you've not subscribed to the channel, then please maybe consider subscribing. It does help the channel and it's free at the end of the day. I'm going to go live this Friday night. I know I've mentioned it in a few videos. Um, it'll be around about eight o'clock. So if you're new to the channel, please drop in and say hello. Um, maybe do a quiz. And we'll just sort of, you know, have a, have a few beers and we'll let our air down and we'll see where, see where the night goes. So what I'll do, I'll, I'm going to bring you back now when this is hopefully done. So there it is, look. See what you think of that. Now, it's been a long, long time since I've cooked gammon. So it's it's one of them where if you cook it, overcook it, it goes dry. I mean, I like it so it is a little bit, obviously, moist. And there's the fat. I do like that fat as well. So I'm just going to chop it in half. This, Yeah, that's good. That's good, have a look at that, see what you think. Oh, it's salty, it's gonna be oh I'm salivating already. And there's the fatty bit, look. I'm gonna have, I'm gonna get I'm gonna have that as well because I do like that fatty bit. We all like a bit of fat. Fat is flavour, isn't it, they say? So let's tell you what, I'll get that bit there. Let's get into that. The end bit, the end bit first, and then we'll go with that fatty bit. Mm. 
I never seasoned it neither. I do apologise talking with my mouth full. Mmm. <laughs> it's thick bacon, isn't it? And who doesn't like bacon? Oh, that is good. Look at the fat there, look. You just know that's going to be really... I mean, you can cook it. You can, it depends how you like it, doesn't it? But I, do, I don't like mine too dry. And this is a pub classic. Gammon. And they say, do you want, do you want pineapple or egg? And, and I say, I, I want both, please. I want pineapple and egg and um, chips and peas, please. <laughs> and some bread and butter as well. Bread and butter. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> Have a look at that. See what you think. It, it's it's going a bit dry here, look, you can see. I've got to be very careful. I mean, it depends how you like it, doesn't it? You might like it like that. You might like it, like, might like it crisp. You might like it done fried in oil, but I like mine grilled. And it's just sort, of, just sort of juicy in the middle, if you know what I mean. Well, not so much. Well, it's got added water as well. You have to remember that. It is, you know, it's nowhere near top of the range, is it? Let's be fair. So it's produced using EU and non-EU meat. It is, it's, it's, it's moist. It's well seasoned. I never added any more salt. It's not too overly smoked neither, it's a mild smoke. Sometimes it can be like really smoky, but that's just a mild smoke and I don't mind that. I like it, I do like it. I like the, the fat that runs through it as well, give it a bit more flavour and to be honest, that, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't have minded maybe that fat to have gone all crispy. I like the ends as well to have fat on and it, when it curls up, it just you get a tinge on the ends. And it goes hard, well not hard, but it, it goes crispy and that fat is all crispy. And it intensifies the salt flavour in it. Really is tasty. Stick some pineapple and an egg on there. Or a couple of eggs even. And a good wedge of pineapple. A load of peas and chips. You know, perfect. Absolutely perfect. But I'm just having that as it is. I'm trying to lose weight. <laughs> I'm going live Friday night, 8 o'clock. Please join us if you're, if you're um, around and about and you're not going out. Maybe tune in. We'll have, a, we'll have some festivities uh, going on in here. Make a clown of myself, like I always do. No, 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 uh, no change there. Right, I'm going to get into this now. Might stick it in a sandwich. Load of ketchup. <laughs> So take care, all the best, and I'll catch you on the next one.